Hello everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome on into the Obsidian Grounded Casually 
Grounded stream. Wow. Okay. Hi. Uh, I'm Eric Dorbell, the community manager here at Obsidian, and I'm joined with uh, Shia Schofield, who's the social media manager, and the amazing and talented animator, Zach Spurlock. What's, what's, what's going up? on, guys? How are you guys doing? Doing good. Hi. Hello. Hello, Excited everybody in chat. Yeah. So today, uh, we're going to begin our playthrough that we left off from last week. And we're going to actually start building a base of operations. And then we can, after that, we can start going into exploring story stuff and content like that. Uh, so we specifically have uh, Zach here, who's an animator on Grounded. Uh, he's animated all the humans, uh, some of the sweet bugs. And uh, so if you have animation specific questions, uh, Zach is here to answer those. Uh, we're going to hold a Q&A probably towards the last 20 minutes of the stream. Um, so please hold off on your questions but if they do happen to pop up sporadically uh, we may answer them and uh yeah let's let's get to it yay oh eric do you want to let everyone know what we plan to do today what our goals are oh yeah absolutely and i i should have switched scenes we are also going to have <laughs> two giveaways today one yeah. is a peat mask face mask uh that's in the style of his, his uh, button-up shirt and the second giveaway is a steam key for grounded so uh we'll probably do those giveaways later towards the you know middle of the stream perfect and then oh to participate in those they need to follow our channel correct yeah you need to follow the channel to enter the giveaway and then uh, I'll set up the, the giveaway bot yeah. to queue up a keyword that you guys will have to enter. Or I might just make it more active so we don't just spam chat with the giveaway. That way we can see people's questions and comments and stuff like that. Hmm. I think it's bedtime. Oh, here's our here's our uh, dinky base right um, now. So here. It's not really a base. Nice. It's, uh, it's just a, a lean-to and a workbench. Probably some very spawn point. Yeah. Well, it's a start. Yeah, I'd like start in the dark. I was like, oh, what's up, Colby? Seconds. Oh no, what happened? I think we went in dark so we can see all the sweet fireflies, but. Yeah, and then when everyone. Oh yeah, it's... <laughs> fireflies are pretty cool all to right. see at night. Sleep time. I still have a backpack no I need joke. to go get to. Sleepy time. I'm gonna okay. let you guys scout out a base. I'm gonna try to grab my backpack real quick to see what I had on it. Yeah, we yes. can uh, try to get someone to. So the the plan of these streams is just casual, but it's uh me and Shyla, and um, and then we will have if a dev has time to join us, they'll join us because I know they're they're super busy and they're a small team. All right, making sure everything's good. I need to build some weapons and stuff, some tools. Yeah, that's a, a goal of ours is to I have a nice start chest. Out there. Oh yeah, all my stuff's broken. <laughs> I, I did die quite a bit to the mosquitoes. <laughs> yeah, those guys are no joke. Let's see, at least get an axe going. Do you guys have a place in mind you want to build a base, or...? Um, I think we'll leave that to you, buddy. Yeah, you're oh. our guest. Help us pick a spot. Okay. I wanna... Well, a place I usually like to build is near the hedge in the flooded area. There's, like, Ooh. some little islands over there that are kind of um, a good deterrent for most creatures. Although, I guess there's mosquitoes there now, so they might not be deterred by that. <laughs> Now that I think about it. We can go scout it out. Yeah, you can go over to the hedge you guys want. Okay. Just gathering stuff. Kill us. Yeah. Uh, you're right, ABC Milkman. No pressure. We gotta pick the best premium location. Yeah. <laughs> the prime real estate. It matters. But I'll you save you! Is whether or not you like the spot. Okay. Take Let's have a good view. I somehow yeah. forgot uh, to yeah, make things last time. 
Oh, the tree is. It's like half the game is making things. I know. I just, I'm. It just didn't happen. <laughs> I made a spear <laughs> and some armor, but everything else. You know, I might have chucked my axe and hammer at bugs because I was trying to run. Oh, <laughs> I do recall that. <laughs> Got a bunch of tutorials popping up. Uh, we haven't built yet, Blaze. Uh, we're. I think we're gonna. Where are we going? By the hedge? Uh, you want to go to the hedge? Yes, yeah, head that way. There's your markers. I am I think 52 I'm paying the right way. centimeters away. Oh, you know what? I have a backpack. There's my stuff. I'll grab some thistles while I've found a thistle plant. Ooh. Because every time I'm looking for these, I can never find them. You built near the, the berry bush? That's a good spot. Gotta get those yeah. berry chunks. Oh, yeah, the berries. Mm hmm. I need to find the rare berry resource. Some water. Let's see, there should also be. Yeah, I'm gonna die of starvation soon. Oh, I please need my don't. Food. Oh, good. <laughs> good honeydew. Yeah, there's a field station around here somewhere. I know there's some stuff I need to analyze. Oh, gonna be quiet. All right, I'm gonna grab my backpack. Hopefully, a mosquito doesn't kill me. Or a spider. It's usually a spider here. <laughs> Thanks, Nate. Yeah, people oh, were mentioning that I look like Sal so Volcano cute. or Volcano Volcano. I don't know. I don't know who that was. And then you showed me a picture, and I was I don't like, know who "That is either." Oh God, nope. I'm oh, I'm gearless. Web. It's a Six soldier ant, web. and I don't have any gear on. <laughs> I'm get oh shit. Okay. Trying to gather this while we no spiders around, so it's a good time to gather some webs. That's because they're sleeping. Yeah, we're we're looking currently into looking into that um and Crowley. Uh, we believe it might have to do with the insider conflicting with the normal build, so we're we're having the we're, we're currently looking into and seeing what we can do to fix that. Okay, I will <laughs> say I love the baby spiders so much. <laughs> So okay. cute, aren't they? Oh my god, yes. look at all that stuff. I love when they come out and they have their one little hand Oh, his weevil like... caught in this web. Do I have... Where? I'm gonna kill it. Oh. can probably make a shield. Repair? Which is a brand new feature. Bam, look at that. The new feature where your equipment no longer takes inventory space. Yeah, I'm so glad we got that in. Yes! Soda pop. Cool. Uh, God, so I have so, so much stuff. Here's some water. Oh, this is a soda pop. You know, it's fine. It's good enough. All right, we're at the area. Oh, I wanted oh, this one. Um. Oh, got an ant trying to kill a weevil. Oh. Okay. Yes, give me Where all the knowledge, all the science. There we go. Thistle. Much needed thistle. You guys, we can build the basketball Jesus, hoop. Charges. That's it. What do we need? Oh, we still need to analyze mite fuzz. Oh, I just want to build the basketball hoop, and that's it. I think we're done. <laughs> that is our Yeah, base. That's, that's the end game. <laughs> Thanks, Slander. Oh, what do you say? He's been playing since the beginning of launch, and he absolutely loves what we've been doing with the game. Thank you so much. Keep up the great work. Well, you keep up the great playing. Thank you. Saw someone uh, well, when we, we first also need. Dude, can we build a shovel yet? Oh, that's what we need to get eventually is some acorn shells so we can mm. build a shovel, and then we can dig the clay and build foundations if we want. We don't have to. And I am going yeah. to... There's usually some islands. Like, yeah, that like... sounds great. Okay, if we could pick an island, I can build a marker, and then that way we can go get some acorns and then come back. There's like and... one specific island. I think this is it. I don't know. The thing is, you have to do a lot of clearing out of like clovers and grass in some of these places. But... And I hey, found... someone found rash. Yeah, hey. bell toad. Oh, I need water. I 
remember when I used to swim in this flooded zone and the water fleas would just come up for a hug and now they attack you. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I think there's a period where they did not attack you. Yes. Oh, honey do would do. I gotta drop. Drop. Eat the honeydew. I've had words. Is this yes. where we're gonna build our base? Yeah, we can build it here. I think it like next to the battle toad is probably good, or on the same landmass as battle toad. I like spot. I like that. Build a a temple around the battle toad. Um, I don't know how do you guys want to set it up, or if it matters. Probably probably over here because it's less stuff to clear out. Cool. Be a lot of manual labor. Oh, yes. Where's my rock? Rock. Chuck. We're gonna use the mustache. Hydration is the key for to now performance. until I can go back and change that other home oh, base icon. What are you doing, Aphid? Okay, so here is our landfall. Let's... I'd like to start with the door just so we know where that's gonna be. So you guys have a preference. I hear. Our right, little spider buddy. Oh, more spider buddies. Okay, I'm gonna go try to get some acorn. Goodbye, oh, water fleas. Good idea. I miss you. I love you. Oh my lord! I was like <laughs> a block master last week, and this week I'm getting pooped on. <laughs> Make clover armor. Do I even make a camera hammer? Any more bench for that. Yeah. See, I'm 90, 80 oh. centimeters away. I might be able to come. Say I that. got 15 seconds. I... Let's see. Oh no, my st Oh no, I am coming yeah. up the <laughs> butt side of the spider. I am not going to be able to get around him. I'm definitely not close enough. Sorry, bud. It's okay. It is what it is. I should have been there. Oh, I'm sitting to die by misadventure. That's I love right. those little phrases. <laughs> <laughs> I am so hungry. Fire. I see it. Well, at least I refilled uh, some of my food and water. <laughs> Yeah. It's the quick way. Just die and get some food water back. Can't waste food. Can't waste food. Can't waste food. <laughs> Go away, gnats. So are you responsible for the gnats booping into me all the time? <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, I'm actually... actually uh, no, I didn't do anything. That's all AI stuff that I think... I can't remember who, because we got Nats a while ago, so I think that was before BMAC, or maybe BMAC worked on it. I can't remember, it was either Jake or BMAC, or maybe Robbie. One of the programmers is responsible for the AI um, of them booping into you all the time. And I think uh, Kaz had a little bit to do with that. And Ian made the model and got the legs to dangle and the wing texture. So I didn't actually do anything with the mat with the Nats. Ooh. What you're saying is it really does take a nice sized team of you guys to come together to build stuff like that. Yeah, everything is, it's never usually just one person. It's a team effort for sure. But if you, didn't do the, if you didn't do the gnats, what was one of the favorite creatures you have worked on? Or even if it wasn't a creature? Um, I think uh, one of my favorites was the larva, just cause um, I just like the look of him and the way, just the way his body shape was. He was kind of fun to animate because um, he's just like the most alien looking thing to me. Um, or one of the more alien looking bugs and he's just fun to do all around. I think like by that time we had a lot of how we were doing creatures figured out like as far as what they needed for animation sets. So I just knew like what I needed to do for everything uh, on that creature and it was just kind of fun to work on. I will say, um, after Welcome you kill it. the larva and you go to harvest it, and the way it just comes apart, 
<laughs> one of my favorite things ever. <laughs> yeah. That's all um John Lewis and Ian uh made that system for the the jib system or the the loot chunks. So it's cool. good stuff. It's, it's always so interesting when I talk to anyone um from your team and just to hear like I think I know like one person did this because of the title and then I find out that it's really so collaborative. Yeah. Definitely. Oh, to make suggestions in the Discord, you have to read the guidelines, and then you have to agree to the guidelines by doing a little emote, and then you'll be able to to uh, put up your suggestions in the in the grounded Discord. Thirsty. I have a whole bunch of acorn shells, so I think I will analyze and head on back. I'll be we back for you, Weevil. New... Do it. I'll be we back. Need to build a new uh, lean-to out there, right? Oh, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> that seems important. Listen, I need the Weevil shield. It's important. That is also important. That tastes really good. Sure. Um, Hoops the with the hops. So yeah, I like the little noises they make. I've, yeah. I ended up calling every single one I find Walter, so that way, no matter what, it's always my friend Walter. Even if it's not the same, it is. <laughs> oh, Walter. It's a good weevil name. Right? Oh, Walter look at you, weevil. building this sweet round wall. What's going on here? I haven't decided on uh, what I like to call the bees, oh. if it's Beatrice or Beatrix. <laughs> oh. Those and then you can just good. shorten it to Betty the Bee. It's like, yeah. Arthur the ant. It makes me feel more at home when stuff. I play the game. Yeah. <laughs> it humanizes them a little. Yeah, I don't do that to the spiders, but I put a little, <laughs> put a little chest right here, oh. real quick. No. Let me set up a wing to here because uh, I'm just not doing that. Okay, you stay away, Bombadil Beetle. I guess I'll just put it here. Respawn point. Oh yeah, I need, need some some fire. Cook some meat. I have to clear out some stuff here. Yeah, I need to drink something so bad. I'm, I'm gonna go find water. Oh here, right here. There we go, a little gnat meat. That's not so bad. Oh, where's where's our little aphid friend I have out here? There you are. Yeah, you're gonna be you're gonna be a tasty little little treat. Poor guy. Look how cute he is being cooked. I love it. Uh -oh, I love watching is... that um, <laughs> transition. Hello, friends. Hello, like... everyone coming on in. Yeah, this is Hello. my favorite thing is watching the meat rotate. The aphid spit roast. Yeah, 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 there you go. I think that's something like that was one of the early ideas. Like someone just mentioned, like, I want to see aphids roasting on spit. <laughs> And like, yeah, that's a perfect idea. Yeah, boom, let's make it happen. Here I come, I'm swimming to the new base. Bringing with me plenty of acorns. Awesome. Oh, let me set my need that Need on. a sizzle sound? You know, that's that might be a good idea. Yeah. Some sizzling medium rare aphid. I need a. I hate to hunt the ants, but I need to to get their ant armor. <laughs> uh, this is a uh, day one on the base. Yesterday, uh, last week we uh, we had Adam Brennicky, the game director, on, uh, and we. He was just uh, telling everyone about the new update and, and all that good stuff. And uh, and today we're, we're here with Zach, who's the animator on Grounded. Uh, and, he's, and we're building his, his dream home. Oh, I know this is my dream home. Yep. <laughs> it is now. <laughs> Probably would have done a better job. <laughs> yeah. It's a work in progress. Yeah. Yeah, we can always tear it down and renovate. 
Can you switch views? Absolutely. You just press U on the old keyboard. I don't know what it is on the, the controller. Down on the D-pad and then the very top of the And then, boom. Third person view. Yeah. Pretty easy. Yeah. Oh, I need a repair yeah. tool. <laughs> we need yeah, it. I think that's one of the biggest things we wanted for this game was um, trying to get third person and first person working um but uh there's still a lot of a lot i want to do to polish this up and make it look better especially for third person because a lot of the stuff i do for human animations are made specifically for first person so it fits within the frame of the camera and it might not always look good in third person but i try i try sometimes to make it look good in both but sometimes it's just not possible um so there's a lot of polish work I need to do um, that I want to do eventually. It's just uh, finding time, but we're slowly getting there. It's still in early access, and we're constantly improving it. Oh, look at all the fireflies coming in! Yeah. Fireflies? I don't know. It's like a fleet. Yeah, it's a squadron. I was like, "What is that noise?" And I look up, and I'm like, "Oh, nice." Yeah, I was a little worried about how we were going to get flying creatures working at first because, like, we haven't done that before, but it came out pretty nice, so I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. Yeah, I, it adds so much life to the game, especially, like, when you're mm -hmm. first starting out, leaving the, the ravine, and then I just look up and I see a bee flying by. I'm like, oh, this is amazing. Uh -huh. Yeah. Gives you more reasons to look up. Yeah, when you guys first brought the update of the pond... Broke and brought the water creatures. I was like, this is amazing. It can't get better. And then you guys brought in the flying creatures. And I was like, oh, yes. <laughs> and now yeah, let's, I got cool. some clay. Oh, I can't it. swim with planks. Um, Hold do on. you have quartzite by any chance? Or? No. no. I broke my axe. Oh, yeah, I got <laughs> I'll put it in the chest. I got a ton. <gasps> you have oh, some? Yeah. Stick. People yeah. can upgrade. Uh, Where is it? Boom. Get those repair tools. You're a hero. Thank you. I try. I'm just, I'm just hoops. <laughs> I'm just hoops. I need to store some of this stuff. I need to make something. I need to make armor. Uh, how much ink horns do we have? Okay. Yeah, if we need more, I can go. I like how you built next to these mushrooms. I'll probably go with you just so we could, you know, maximize our acorn profits <laughs> dark side asks who's is zach's favorite dev episodian just a fan with no ties in zoro want to know hmm i wonder caleb i wonder yeah good question let's say his name starts with a c and ends with a b <laughs> that's all i'll do oh hold on i need to set my respawn yeah and and then uh, I'm gonna try to take on this firefly. Ooh. Oh. Do you have armor on? I have a. Uh, I have clover armor on. You got this. Okay. <laughs> oh wow, we. I'll probably help. Got him. I got him. Nice. Well, oh, good job. Thanks, guys. Oh, his no his friends aren't too happy though. <laughs> oh, I need some bow and arrows. Yeah, I've been meaning to craft one of those, but I, I forget every time. Oh, that was a lot of damage! <laughs> oh my goodness! Stab me in the back! Shit, I need to eat. I'm back. Oh, hey, I'm back. Okay, I'll step over here. Oh, I was trying to craft first aid. No, get off, Bally. It's coming! Oh, where's Zach? <laughs> he went to get water. <laughs> um, I don't think... Oh, no. You said your respawn point there. Yeah, I'm, I'm right things. there in front. Oh, you just came, too. Oh, oh crap. I'm dead now. I was just reviving you. I guess the timer ran out. I was gone for a while, sorry. I'm a bad friend.
friend. Oh, you're still here. I got you. Oh, thank you. You're a good friend. I'm a bad friend. I was sure that. No. Was well, you were you were reviving me, and I and I hit release. I feel like it. Up there is my chest. Oh my goodness. They hurt so bad. I need to weave a shield. <laughs> I've got you, hoops. Oh. Yes. Let me in, Oh crap. Oh crap. My health is low. Whoa. Their health is low too. You guys I need get more, this. I need more stamina. This guy's almost dead. I have to like yeah. jump up to hit him. I know I need to really make go. that bow and arrow. I need the spring bow. Oh, I thought I could hide behind the grass. The thing is these guys are primarily ranged, so they won't try if, to get close if to you to attack you. Pete and Hoops had a name, would it be Team Poops? No, Chinner. <laughs> Darn it, Chinner. <laughs> <laughs> I like that joke, Chinner. It's okay. Oh, hey. Willow. I'm Willow. not attacking. We're all friends here. Well. Oh, oh my god, there's three. Did you just attack me? Am I up? Come up nice. Shh, dog. Whoa, there's three of them. I didn't see them. Oh my god. Willow, Willow! I'll just keep going, going back and well. forth. Hey, Thanks for saving me. Here, run go. away. Okay. Uh. What? Get off, Valley! Let's probably just leave them alone if we, yeah. if we respawn here. Hoops, back in the game! Yeah. Run away. yeah they're, they're still. Oh, I'm just gonna give up so I can t lose aggro. <laughs> yeah, they really do not like you. <laughs> All right. Oh, we need some nap fuzz to make bone arrows. Oh, we have some nap fuzz. The only problem with I'll our make base them right quick. now is that we don't have a roof to keep the fireflies out. <laughs> Oh, I got some clay too. I need a repair. Yeah, let's tool. uh, let's work on making a roof too. Oh, repair. Oh, do I have all this stuff? I accidentally grabbed everything. So crude rope, sprig, and. Oh, I don't have armor glue. Can I make armor glue now? Oh, I need this lamp. I need it in my life. Sap? I need I more, got, more sap. I made a bow and some arrows, so we can probably take these guys out. Oh, and then I made a distance. repair tool. They're yeah, just hanging out there. There's guys. We'll just let them. They're just, yeah, they're just having a good time. Let's just ignore them for now. <laughs> I think I took all the acorn shells, so we'll have to go get more. Uh, does the firefly lamp run out? Yes. Yes, I believe the headlamp works just like the torch and other light sources. But what's nice is wearing that, you get to keep both hands free, so. And it gives you a really cool green glow wherever you look. Uh, we still need to finish this wall. Got some. Yeah, yeah uh, every Wednesday we'll be doing Casually Grounded. Uh, unless, you know, we're on holiday. Which... T tend not to run on Wednesdays. So. Yeah. Ah. Where did that go? Oh, we need more. Samurai, are you talking about the gamepad such as a controller on the PC? Yeah. Ah. PC. So I do. Yup. Yeah. 
it worked out. I started playing that way first. Oh, look at all these and then grass I just plants. Haven't gone back. Yeah, I kind of need to build a bridge just to collect them. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. And now it's the one. They can reach some of these. Nope. What can we do here? What can we do here? I need some like acorn I think armor. We're, those are just lost cause. Unless like we we got something to nudge him towards us. <laughs> it does not work. I got one. Oh, I can think I, we like, built our swim? wall, so we're okay for now. What if I swim and push them to the edge? I think oh, that's a Oh yeah, that that'll work. Idea. They're physics driven. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Perfect. Get one of these guys. Get some fuzz. Probably. You guys want to sleep? Uh, yeah. So you can see better. I need another door. There we go. Tiny Pete's ready for some tiny rest. Oh, that is so cute. Tiny Pete's ready for some <laughs> tiny rest. <laughs> oh, Tiny Pete, how I love you. Okay, back to swimming and pushing. Nice. Look at that. Teamwork. Yeah. Now to grab awesome. my hammer, because I threw it. <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping that would help, but it did not. Uh, no new story stuff uh, yet there, Kate. No, but if you have it yet, there's plenty of uh, audio logs to go find. That should help give you a sneak peek into some things that's going on. Oh, I hear you. I hear him. Okay. Uh -oh. So we probably want to build a roof. Or... Take that, water flea! Ooh. Oh, hi, Shinobi. Need, uh... Oh, I got those. A little crooked, but that's okay. Nice. Uh, was the writing the voice lines a team effort, or was it work of a writer? Uh, um, I think that was... We, we had a, we hired a writer named Michael Chu for a while, and he, I think he did a lot of writing for stuff like that. Uh, not sure, and some, some people, like, contributed, uh, lines here and there to have the character's voice, but I'm not exactly sure who. I think Adam would know better. I feel a little less squishy now. You are a little less squishy, Tiny Pete. If it roast. That should keep me safe. So that's why I wish I was Max, because he loves to eat everything. I know. <laughs> He's so happy about it all too. Where's my thing? Here we go. I need to craft a weapon um, and then. Goop. Were we gonna try to head out to the the ant hill? Yeah, we need to get some some ant stuff. Yeah, that sounds good. Do some adventuring. Yeah, let me. I know I'm a picky eater, but still. clear my inventory. Grab some mushrooms for the road. Much. Oh, I need some fiber. Get rid of that. You guys need to go away. Keep those. Keep some rocks handy. Got me bow. And they just love that spot so much. I bet if I attack and run. <laughs> <laughs> you sure you want to do that? <laughs> yep. 
Too late. <laughs> oh. Oh, you know what? We need oh. to. Oh, you did build a workbench. Fantastic. Follow me. Oh no, they're coming after me. No, no, no. Oh, no. Take them to the water. We're just trying to help you guys. Go live your life. I'm here. Blank attack. Take my rock. Wow, we. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh no. son, get oh, it. Stunned him. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh no. Someone help me. I'll use the at least. Okay, good. Perfect. Yeah, so one of my goals is to build a lure arena okay. and then we'll have a bunch of bugs battle it out. I can't wait for that. Yes. Wait. No. <laughs> I thought there were only three. Where'd this other guy come from? Oh. Are we all, oh, we're all down. Yeah. Just give up. Oh, okay. Well, at least we're still close to home. Man, we are we're having a rough go of fireflies. Yeah, we need some uh tier two armor. That uh slowdown effect from the goop is pretty gnarly. Yeah. Pick up the arrow. Cool. There's another one. Oh yeah, I needed to craft. Weapon. He's just minding his, minding his own biz. Yeah, let's get some ant parts. I really want an ant club. Yeah, we need some stun yeah, power. Let's head, let's head to the ant hill. Yes. Right, make sure I have enough space. Yeah, we're going need on an adventure. Clover. You go say hi to the ants. Just say hi. Maybe give them a high five. Definitely not murdering them for body parts. <laughs> I'm going to an ant harvest. <laughs> go away, water flea. You don't want none of this. Yeah, before they were um, hostile enemies, when they were just uh, neutral or passive in there, they were so cute. <laughs> I would just go swim and watch them like float around. Like, oh, here's yeah. here's some. Wow, they is. I'll take that weevil. Oh, you no, stole the weevil the from weevil. me. I, you, oh, I guess right yeah. I gotta I blend in. Anyway. <laughs> Become the ant. Plus, we're next to a field station, so we'll be able to. Oh, did someone yeah, stab me? Analyze these real quick. So there's actually a spider that hunts ants, and what it does is the ants it kills, it attaches to its body to produce, to mask itself with the ant pheromones. I like that. That's pretty awesome. That would be kind of creepy. This goes around saying, "How do you do, fellow ants?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Here's the field station. If you guys, oh, and there's a spider. Let's not go that way. Uh, yeah, zero point six point one is uh, out right now. Let's take spider three on Walter. one. Uh, which ant hill do you guys want to go to? The main one, the big ant hill, right? Yeah. The one by the oak tree or the uh, one. The dry grass. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what to call that. The dry cla uh, dry grass right. plateau. <laughs> dry oh, land here. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey get back here. Yeah. Near uh, the stinky Near the gulp. Haze. Mm -hmm. All oh, those so stink bugs like to chill. I don't think we have that much sap. No. Then we I'll, need I'll uh, get some of that. healing. So that'll be good. Oh, hi, DB. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna change you. Yeah, our makeshift base. But I want to leave it here for like yeah. memories, in case memories. we need a workbench in the middle of the yard. Need a lot of mite fuzz. Ooh. I think yeah. If we want to get mite fuzz later, by the plank, 
or not the plank, the big tree branch usually has a ton of mites. Uh, we will be going to till 2.30 uh, Pacific time. So right now it's 1.43, so we have about 45 minutes. So this is science. Explorer. Mutation. Now, I'm going yeah. to meet you guys. Oh, well, actually, before we go to the ant hill, should we go see if we finish talking to Burgle to get some daily quests? Uh, yeah, oh, we do have like we have three right now. Oh, oh we, we have do? two. Perfect. I have not checked that yet. We need two markers yeah! at Spade Gulch and yeah! the Great Oak Beacon. Perfect. All right, spiders, I'm ready. Oh, really soldier ants. Oh, yeah. Practice, oh, okay. practice my blocking. a bee up ahead or above us um I, th I think the workaround to get the latest update on the xbox is to uninstall the game and then reinstall it hey, okay, nice we're here for your body parts <laughs> <laughs> your boots and your bike. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. I need your ant body, your ant head. I cannot see. Oh, I stabbed you. So sorry. Ooh. That torch might be good here. I got it. <laughs> oh no. Whoa, where'd that guy come from? Gosh. Yeah, make sure you're unroll uh unenrolled from the 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 PTS flight. Hello everybody. I don't think I can make it to you. There's so many ants. I believe I believe Oh wait, maybe I can. You're gonna be okay. can get in just watching you. They're just watching you. We're all good. Nice. Ants stuck. He's, he's, oh, no. What? Can't Wait, what? Farewell, my friends. I'm not gonna oh, make it. You? What's going on here? Oh no. Well, Maybe it's run. because the ant is on me that's causing some weird bugs. Yeah. Maybe. Know. I have like eight seconds. It's fine. Okay. Uh, I'll be back. I don't think it's... I'll be. I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, I'm in there. Okay, okay. I'm out of here. <laughs> There's so many. Oh, we got a nice question from Tank. Which was the most difficult to animate, the flying or swimming creatures? Um, I'm trying to think. Well, so the thing is, uh, we outsourced some of our animations, and all the flying creatures were outsourced. But I did do some animations on them too, like added some stuff and tweak some things to get them working. And same with the swimming creatures. Um. So I didn't do much on the swimming creatures, but I did do the player swimming animations, and that was difficult to get working right to make it feel good and look good. Um, I'm probably still gonna be tweaking that till the end of time and polishing it up. But yeah, I th I'd say like also the flying creatures, um, like having to animate their legs like while they're flying is a little bit more work because they're not grounded to anything so it's, there's more movement involved with them um that can be difficult uh yeah i guess they have their own sets of challenges what about but player um, swimming animations for sure the player emotes do you have a favorite oh yeah uh i love doing those this is probably my favorite thing to animate on players but uh my favorite is probably the uh air guitar because that, that was yeah just, that one speaks to me so much. <laughs> <laughs> Do a lot of air guitaring in your day. Mm-hmm. Just a fan of rock and metal and so. Would you say that you'd be interested in the new emote suggestions from the players on our Discord site? Oh, yeah. Just play them on me. Just give, give me all your suggestions and we'll probably pick and choose some stuff. I, I We definitely want to do more emotes. Just don't, I'm excited just to do don't, more emotes. Just don't look behind me. Oh, God. I'm... Away. No, oh god, he yeah. webbed me. Where's the web? In their eyes. Oh, that's not my backpack. Are you no. okay in there? Woo. Everybody run. Distract him. Okay, cool. Let's leave. 
How yeah. has it, yeah. uh... Oh, behind us! Hold tank him. Take these. Oh my god. Two behind you. I do. Come on. I'm on the <laughs> way. You guys are having all the action. Run. My dog's, my dog's cheering us on. He is very upset about this. Oh. I am one more hit and I'm dead. Or incapacitated. How many? Jeez. Cartwheels? Oh, then. That might be a good Keep one. Keep moving. Or, I'm sorry. They're right ah. behind you. <laughs> I did. thought my dog was going to keep with barking. Us. I was going to mute, and then he stopped. He just wanted to see me die. <laughs> my dog I just want to see you die. <laughs> He's upset because I'm not playing with him, I bet. A craft all option. Um, that is in the... Oh, hello. Suggestions. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Big guy. Take it easy. Whoa. Oh, oh, kill his gnat. Oh, <gasps> oh, no. oh, that's my fault. I am sorry. <laughs> no, it was the gnat. Uh... Are you guys inside? <laughs> well, the gnats can't do damage. I think I hit I you for sure. <laughs> you hit me. I was trying to pull it off. <laughs> oh, I see you. No, I see you. The... Oh, I'll own up to that. The field station. Well, that's fine, because now... Um, I'm back. killed me once, and Eric has killed me once, so... Oh. Yeah. Okay. Got a... Yeah. I feel good about it. Got a record going. Yeah. Puppy? Maybe the next dev that joins can kill you too. We're playing on medium. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, soldier ant, so I'm ready baby for you. Mode. This... Oh, I can fight put my Oh he's turned to me now. Yeah. Oh no. Back up. How many hit parts do we have now? I have a pretty good amount to maybe craft the whole set. I don't have that much. I thought I had more. I guess you guys were looting them more. Uh, I have five parts ah! and one head. Hi, yeah! Saber, just stick on. Oh my gosh. I got, I got you, buddy. It's Hi, Saber, just to stick on the outskirts here and get them as they come out instead of I was going sure that was the deep end. into their home. There. I mean, I don't oh, like there you go. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. There's oh, like there's four of them. Hold on. Let's just. Oh, just my out. Just my out. spike broke. My sticks catch it my broke. Breath. I'm gonna. Someone draw them away and I'll try to circle okay. around and get I back think. to Eric, maybe. Nope, Co I'm coming. I'm coming around. Wait, are oh, you guys. Oh, down there oh there yeah, are so I many. Down. Maybe I can do this before the next animation attack. No! no, no. <laughs> okay. It's up for a second. Uh, uh, Someone help me! I've got you, Boots. It's, it's, oh, it's, it's no over. You're, you're surrounded. I, I need some assistance. I'll just, uh. Yeah. <laughs> Heading back no hope. from the backpack. Uh, the team's always looking into new building materials. You know, as, you know, as it is, the game is in early access, so. Uh, things are always in the works. I love the fact that there's you can track the distance and that it's in centimeters. And that I can yeah. not only track markers in my backpack, but I can see where you guys are in relation to me. Oh! It makes me feel so safe. Oh, that is a spider. Hey, that good. does not make me feel safe. <laughs> good to see you guys here. Thanks for joining us on oh. the Casually Grounded. Ah. If I stay up here, he can't get me. <laughs> who's, who's, hey, friends. Who's attacking me? Not the aphid. Oh. No, you got a baby spider behind you. Yeah, you want to go? Baby. Okay, the grass. Die, baby. Yeah, we got him. Nailed it. So this is my disguise on how to stay alive when a spider attacks. You like it? <laughs> oh my gosh, where are you? <laughs> on top of the, the right. <laughs> I get it now. <laughs> I, I'm a little Can't, slow. Oh, there you here. are. Come on. Well, spider up here. Um, yeah, that's why you just well. You can continue hunting ants or just take our winnings and when we get our backpacks, I mean. Should start 
building Ugh. a set because at least if one minimum one of us is stronger then that improves all our chances yeah i'll grab my backpack yeah. and start going armor I crafting have some acorn armor on right now i think i have oh, only cool. the yeah the legs and chest equipped so i'm good you guys can it is these you guys What's the easiest way to kill a wolf spider? Um, I mean, I've seen a lot of people. Yeah, running just is a good one. A lot of grit. Uh, a ton of a ton of arrows. I like the ladybug tactic. Oh man, they are on guard. Look at that. Okay. Cool if you can get like a wolf spider to attack something else, like a ladybug. Or a yeah. Couple ladybugs mm -hmm. and so, get them to fight to the death. Sometimes, oh my yeah, my strategy is to jump on a ladybug and hope the spider attacks it, and then it's it's like tag team battle royale. Cool. Definitely the pro strats. Okay. And then, run, yeah, run, 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 run. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to our our tiny base to make some armor. Cool. The one with the X. Yeah. Oh, that's what that is. Yeah. But if you practice your perfect blocking, um, that will help a lot. And we also have the Weevil Shield now, which uh, may increase your odds. I love Thank you, Mimeopolis. Can I gonna craft some armor? Oh, and I love that oh. I can pick up stuff in the water now. I need and to go. In order to drink, you have to hold down X, so I don't accidentally. Need drink to kill X some mites water. to make this work. Oh, let's go. Okay, okay let's go to the um tree branch. I think they have a lot of mites there. Usually. Oh, which way? Is... I'm trying to remember where that is. Oh, there's some. There <laughs> I think it's this way. I just remember over. I mean, yeah, there's, by... there's a ton right here. There's usually some here. Yeah, here we go. The, Where they be? The Where they be? Cord. Rude. Sap. Yes. Yeah, get that sap. Yeah. Yes, branch. Give it to me all. Here we go. I'm gonna grab some quartzite while we're here. Sneaking around. Do it. Yeah. Hey, little mite. Where are your friends? I just want to say hi. <laughs> These guys are lazy over here. Oh no! I broke my spear. It's time to punch. <laughs> time to punch. Oh, hello. My ex is about to break. This is science! Speaking of raw science, I wonder if I can run up to the top and grab the. I can make um, you a spear if you need one still. So. Oh no, I'm gonna real quick try to run up, grab this Gabby flavor, and then run away. Oh yeah. Mint armor? That sounds awesome. <laughs> yeah, put that in the Yo, suggestion I'm, boards. I'm down for mint armor. No. I should have armor. the flavor. <laughs> Oh yeah, there's a lot of good mites over here. I will be back for my backpack. Honestly, if I had mint armor, I would be hard not to, to eat my own armor. Yeah. <laughs> I would just craft it so I can eat it. <laughs> See, and then you get into, if you can make in, mint armor, shouldn't I be able to make armor out of Archer's cookies? Shouldn't I be able to make armor out of a Billy Hog's hot dog? Uh, you know... If you want to smell like hot dog laid out in the backyard. <laughs> Just imagine making nah. something out of the bun. You'd be able to jump off anything and it'd be like your own little bubble. Yeah, it's like a bubble wrap, but you're just in hot dog buns. Let's <laughs> yeah. make like a hot dog suit or something. This game needs one. I do love, I will say, the Billy Hogs hot dogs is amazing. How much might we and have? The, the gas station across the street with their little mascot, the Quick Billy. Oh, here he is. Let me see. Quick Billy. It's five. The get seven. Jet. Eleven. Yes. Oh, a, that logo. We need a lot more Mite it's Fuzz. It's so cute. We need 33 Mite Fuzz. I don't know how much you guys have. 
Uh, I will check when I get my backpack away from seven. the bombardier. I also have seven, so we need uh, a little bit more. Does anyone want to try to do a suicide mission? <laughs> That'd be hopefully. a good way to end. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully you wouldn't die. I just need someone to come. End with a bang. There we go. Distract uh, the bombardier beetles so I can try to pick up my backpack. You saw a stream with a ton of fishes? Uh, I don't know how that's possible. There's only one koi fish. Unless Were you're talking tadpoles? about tadpoles. Oh, yeah. yeah. Tadpoles. Those water little guys. Bowmen. I like the, the water. water I love the water bowmen. <laughs> Dude, I had forgotten all about water boatmen until I saw them in the game. Uh, they used to be, they used to live in the chlorinated pools up north, which was really weird. But we would like pick them out and be like, yay, it's a little friend. <laughs> Bring it on. Bring it on. Those are weird. Like, I've learned about so many new bugs from working on this game. <laughs> no, no. Okay, I'm running. I got my backpack. I if got you, a scabby. Yeah, thing. I see a lot of people post like, crazy looking insects on the grounded subreddit and it's i'm like oh man we gotta get those in <laughs> yeah no one died that was my suicide mission i'm glad you guys survived <gasps> that hey, got an audio lock Dominant practical technologies dr wendell tolley science household liquids gels and aerosols to fish in that is where my PhD is going now. Kaminsky works here, and he's an idiot. With the pay cut, I've been reduced to substituting at the local school. How many times can one person be expected to explain the difference between a vector and a scalar? If it has direction, then it's a scalar. I mean, a vector. Oh! I swear the ignorance around me is contagious. Hey, Does that normal teacher do anything? No wonder my inventions cannot be appreciated. Our society no longer understands science. Hello. Yeah, you can get a dandelion tuff and use it as a, a glider. Got yeah. the larva blade. Yay. Yeah. Ooh. This is a Andy special. He I think he plays this here. It's a fun little, fun little thing. I like Andy specials. Discovery. Yeah. I love his uh, sweeping broom in Deadfire. Oh, uh, yeah. The, what do they call it again? It was... It had a very clever name. It's the... The Sweeper? Some, no, I think it was something else. I can't remember what it was called. Guys, Andy was here. If someone in chat remembers, please. Well, some of them. Mm, Maybe it was just a sweeper. Around, the Street Sweeper. Thank you, Andy. Yeah. <laughs> the man himself. Yeah, Andy! Know. Oh, you know what? We need to do a giveaway. Totally forgot. We'll yeah. do the first giveaway for... Trying to get out of combat first. For the Pete face mask. Oh, yes. So just stay active in chat for five minutes, and then we'll do a roll. You guys don't have to do any commands or anything. Just, just chat it up. Don't forget to follow the channel. Yeah, follow the channel already. to be eligible. Otherwise, you will not win the sweet Pete face mask. Hey, um, someone hop under this yoked girth and get the spider out for me, please. Thank you. I'll do it. Yes. So there's science in here. There's no spider in here. Oh, okay, I didn't have a torch. Perfect. It's not yeah. Scabby. Perfect. That's what I wanted. The spider comes home. Let me, right let me make leaving. sure the night bot's doing what it needs to do. Yes. Okay. We're good. Just chat it up, friends. If you got uh, more animation questions. I have a little, a little fun fact about me and Zach. Uh, we both went to the same college together and ended up taking a ton of uh, art and animation classes, though we never spoke to each other until <laughs> one day I was walking around the grounds of Obsidian's uh, headquarters and I see Zach and we both look at each other like, hey, didn't we go to school together? And we're like, yeah. <laughs> and yeah, uh, just happens. And then now we're we're besties. <laughs> oh, that's definitely. So sweet. Go Titans. That's right. Okay, so you said the Pete mask. I am going to share that in the chat in case you're yes, curious. Yes, the Pete mask. Which one it is? All right, I'm gonna craft some ant so armor. 
when you say peat face mask, I assume you mean like the medical type mask, or or is an actual mask of Pete's face? Because that's what no. I keep thinking. Of. It's it's a face mask <laughs> with a, his shirt pattern on it. Okay. Um, it's not N95 grade though. It's just a but cool what face if we mask. had like a mask of just Pete's face? I, that would be cool. I would, you know, <laughs> if, if people want that kind of thing, yeah, let's do it. <laughs> let's let's make that. Let's make it happen. No, let's get you know, yeah, let's get rid of this. Yeah, just give us a suggestion. We will check it. Uh, check it out. All right, let's see. I'm just wandering. There I can go. make. And we'll do the drawing in two more minutes. Oh, I'm running over. Is that my backpack? I don't know. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, we can probably make this. All right. Oh, there's an ant's helmet in the, the chest. If anyone has more parts, I can make more stuff. I should. What do you need? Uh, I, need I need a lot of butts. A lot of ant butts. I got a couple. I don't have many ant parts. Got uh, why the peat mask? Because that was the mask we picked to give away today. Yeah, we'll have another mask uh, to give away next week. Surprisingly not terrible. So we also still have some mugs and other goodies. So stay tuned. Not for today, but keep watching every Wednesday. Let's see, I need oh, acid glands and more ant butts. I have ant butts. Alright, what time is it? 2.05? Alright, let's let's just see our first winner. Roll in and it is karate e mouse. Just Ooh. uh just say Ooh. something in chat and our mods will reach out to you to get your uh information. Congratulations. Congrats. Hey, there you go. Congrats on the pea face mask. I'm very jealous. Because that thing was good. Yes. Oh, yeah, I need a ant head. Do we got some acid glands up in here? Anybody have one sap? Yes, uh, I'll I'll probably do. I'll drop a stack in the box. Cool. All right, game over. We built the basketball hoop. <gasps> All right, there's ant helmet and leggings or knee guards in the chest. <laughs> I got dunk it. I'm out. And I'm not good. Oh, I can't. Hey, uh, nice. Good oh my dunk. God, we still have the old. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah! yeah well, yes, I love that sound so much. For the longest time, that was like that would he, they would say that every time, like no matter which character you were, they'd say, "Oh yeah!" Every time you yep. built something. Yeah, I loved it. I loved it. Yeah. I'm glad it's still here. I want to get still one lives. of those. Um, what was it? The, the buttons. <laughs> so I could just walk around the office every now and then, just hit it. Oh and yeah. Goes, oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think, like, Mitch did the audio for that. Heck yeah, you know. can dunk. He, there's no dunk animation? Got it. I don't I think. think it was him. Let me try here. Well, there's no dunk animation now. We got it. Well, it looks like, yeah, it looks. Let's yeah. See. yeah, check it out. Throw it in the suggestion Wow, it's box. harder in third person. Get around to it. Yeah, it is. This is the rest of the stream, guys. It actually <laughs> takes some skill to dunk. <laughs> uh let's see well we're at that part for the q a portion of the chat stream um if you guys have animation specific questions that's why we got uh zach here uh and we'll do our best to answer the some other question technical questions you may have yeah let's see yeah, that's built and then cool 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 let me head over to see what questions <laughs> and be in ground in yeah <laughs> So here we go. You Lago would like to know, Zach, how you got into animating. Oh man, that's a story. Yoga. Um, 
So I went to school for animation um, a while back, and after I graduated, I didn't actually get a job in the game industry for a while. Um, I actually started out as QA here at Obsidian. It's my first game industry job. I worked on Tyranny for about a year. And then after that, they, um, like I was working on animation that whole time during working on Tyranny, um, just polishing up my own work. And I caught the attention of some of the lead animators at the studio. Uh, I just, you know, kept chatting with them over the course of the year, letting them know I was interested in being an animator. And they eventually offered me an internship after I took some tests and showed them my demo reel. And I started as an intern on animation intern on Pillars 2. And I did that for a while, then I uh, was then eventually pro promoted to uh, junior animator, moved on to the expansions, the DLC for Pillars 2, which uh, I was the only animator on that too, on the DLC, but um, those are relatively smaller than Pillars 2. And after the expansions, I moved on to Grounded. I've been on Grounded for two years? I think it's been two years, which is crazy. Almost, or at least a little over two years. Over yeah. Two years, can't remember. The animation of your Undead Dragon in Beast of Winter DLC is mm -hmm. so freaking awesome. Yeah, that was definitely a highlight of that project. That was super fun to work on. Um, that team was super great. And that was one of my favorite animations on, on that project for sure. It's like a, you know, it was just like, they just, it's just a thing where I could just go wild on and just make it look as cool as possible. Which is what I like doing. Uh, what kind of references do you use for animations? Um, I just find videos online. Uh, you can find almost anything like video references of stuff and some will be just like specific animation references like they'll have it slowed down for you you can go through it frame by frame to see how like the body motion works um how it functions and everything and a lot of times i just film myself doing stuff so there's a lot of videos of me somewhere like acting weird and doing funny things uh like the air guitar one for instance i film myself doing that and there's a video of me doing air guitar for as reference for the one in this project. So yeah, a lot of, and I also have like a, at, at the uh, back of the office, I have a large mirror, like right next to my desk, just so I could like, if I need to like act out something, I'll get up and go in front of it. While everybody else is working, I'll be doing some kind of weird dance or something <laughs> in front of the mirror. It's just market research. Yeah. <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> it's animator business. All right, we're going to do another giveaway for Grounded on Steam. Uh, so again, uh, just just hang out and uh, and ask questions and chat it up. And then uh, we'll do that towards the yeah. next five minutes. Uh, Tiger King 77 wants to know how it's been working on a game with such a small team. And this seems to be a popular question that everyone gets yeah. asked once or twice. So what's your take on it? Um, it's it's pretty cool actually because you know since we're so small we have a lot of uh, we have a lot more responsibilities and therefore we have like a lot of ownership over things uh, that you probably normally wouldn't have on a very huge team. So like I, like for example I do a lot of the animation stuff so a lot of my work is just present in this game more than more so than like on a bigger game where there's like you probably have an animation work here but this person did this other part and like oh there's my animation over there and this like scattered throughout but my stuff's more prevalent in here so that's pretty cool you have you just have more ownership over things and a lot of creative freedom um but that's there's also you know since it's so small we have a limited amount of resources and time to do stuff um so that's part of the challenge is just trying to work with what you got and doing the best you can um but it's been rewarding for sure i think to be on a small project like this it's definitely an interesting experience. Speaking of working with what you've got, I've seen a few um, players in the chat want to know what kind of programs you use uh, working on the animations and such mm -hmm. for Grounded. Uh, I use Maya for animation. Uh, I, I've used Maya since I've pretty much all my animation career um, did it in school. I'm doing it here. Um, so that's pretty much all I use for that. And we also do a lot of oh should somebody Sorry. attack the firefly yeah. um He's we also ready. do <laughs> Sorry. i also do a lot of uh 
work in, uh, in the engine Unreal as well. Um, I do, like, half my time is probably spent just doing Maya in Unreal. Oh my god. Someone help me! Uh oh. Okay, take care of the firefly. It was my bad. Where's, where's Pete? Oh, there you go. I, I, I shot the firefly and it ruined everything. <laughs> One tiny piece. I'll avenge you. And he, and he broke our door. <laughs> oh. Stun it. Gotcha. Oh, good stun. Okay, so the tank would like to know, for you personally, did you find it more difficult to animate flying or swimming creatures? I don't know if you talked about this earlier. Yeah, I think we answered that question earlier. Yeah. Okay. Um, but it's like... Perfect. Yeah, it's... it's and they have their own sets of challenges, um, like, I don't know, <laughs> I, I'd say they're about equal. We were talking to Adam last week, he pointed out, and I didn't even think of this, with the fact that with the, the water creatures coming first, you were able to learn oh, some stuff from that before moving to the flying? Yeah. Is there that's, anything that's... that you took from like doing the water first and then you were able to just apply it to the flying and be like, oh, I know what to do here now? Um. Not really that much. That that was mostly for like the way creatures move around, behave in like a 3D space, like an open air 3D space. Because like everything up to the pond, we started working on the pond was everything was on the ground. So it's like everything reacts and behaves as if they're on the ground. But when we go to the pond and in the air, it's like they can move in any direction, and there's no like. I guess there's an up and down, but the, it's more of a th open 360 um, space to move in. So that's the stuff we were able to transfer from uh, working on pond creatures to flying creatures. And that definitely helped uh, get this the flying creatures working for this update. Um, as far as animation stuff, it's, yeah, it's pretty much the same uh, uh, idea as just they're, instead of being grounded, they're in a 3D space, or a uh, more 360 space. Um, but flying creatures do land sometimes, so they have some grounded animations as well. Yeah, I love the way the ladybugs, or not the ladybugs, the uh, uh, fireflies when they land, and then they just sit there and walk around a bit, and then they're like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. done, yeah. we're going back in the air. I just love every single bug sleeping animation. Oh, yes. <laughs> it's the best. Yeah. <laughs> I got stuck recording a ladybug the other day sleeping because they just sound so cute. <laughs> All right, we're going to do the giveaway, rolling it, and Nobby Hobby, if you're here. Yay. um, Yeah, just, just let us know, and boom, oh, there you go. There they are. Uh, our mods will reach out to you uh, to give you your Steam key. Yes, I agree. The spider snores are the best. <laughs> if you can get up if you're brave enough to get up that close I also love it too when you're just walking around and you hear it and you have to stop and be like oh, <gasps> okay no. let's just back away <laughs> uh, interesting thing about sleeping creatures is or sleeping bugs is like I mean what do you imagine a sleeping bug looks like like do you ever like what does it actually look like in real life um, most of the time they just kind of sit there I think when they sleep but we had to like do something different to make it like actually look like they're sleeping or kind of convey that so I like a lot of the sleeping stuff animation stuff is kind of made up or something as that we did to make it look like they're sleeping but they might not actually behave like that in real life it's just kind of you know taking liberties with stuff like that Broken. Oh, there's two uh, ant pieces here in the in this chest. <gasps> you want to grab it up? I can make another helmet real quick, actually. Let me make sure I deposited everything. Oh yeah. They're almost full. There you go. Boom! Another helmet. That should keep me safe. Got a lot of mic guns. Looks like we'll have to do another round of uh, ant hunting. It's a okay. The fact that we've already started with the set, so much better than when we started today. Yeah. 
I think it's all I Zach. Everything. Oh, hi. Thank, thank you guys for the raid. Welcome on into our weekly grounded stream. We're coming to oh. an end pretty close here. We got about 12 minutes left. If you guys have any more questions for us or Zach. Zach is the sole animator here on the grounded game. Well, thank you. Hey. You guys are so nice. Well, I'm happy YPR is a huge fan of uh, of New Vegas. Ask Zach about sitting animations. Yes. <laughs> so... Okay, who said that? <laughs> <laughs> that was... You... What was it? Oh, chat went Where by so go? fast. Dang, I keep I said everything. That... Oh, Yo, Yo Lago! Lago. So that has uh, that is a suggestion made in uh, in the grounded discord. Uh, it has been uh, flagged for dev approval. So um, so that is in the that is in the uh, the spreadsheet that I create too that I showed to the devs of all the suggestions that people players have made in our on our grounded discord. Yeah, I think it's um, can't promise anything, but it's been talked about. A little here and there, but it would be cool to have sitting animations, I think, as well. Oh, I would love to sit around the the rose thing spit, like just at night, and be like, "Oh, yay! Hey, friends, let's watch this meat cook." <laughs> yeah, I get that classic sitting around a campfire, one uh, photo. Oh, some points emotes. Uh, you know, I might, I might be able to to work something on that to get some grounded emotes here for you for to spend your channel points on. <laughs> I thought you just meant the point emote. I was like, it's right here. Oh, the pointing one. Oh, sorry, I thought they meant channel point emotes for the chat. Be that. By the way, I'll still do it. <laughs> yeah. I have seen uh, ladybugs flying a few times. I don't think anything's been said on that. But it sounds like a really awesome suggestion. Just gonna put that out there. Put it yeah, on that, the Discord. <laughs> I think that'd be cool too. That would um, take some reworking, so, but we will probably consider that in the future. Yeah, of all these considerations and stuff, if you guys didn't know, we do have a feature board on the Grounded website, so that way you can go ahead and take a look and a sneak peek to see some of the ideas and stuff that the team is currently discussing um, and trying to figure out whether or not it will be in the game. So you can go ahead and check that out. And then we also have the suggestion on our Discord. Um, you have to read the rules. Once you read the rules and do your little emote thing, you can go ahead and post your own suggestions. Uh, the community there is really great uh, voting on them and discussing the suggestions and that way the higher, the more people who vote on the suggestion, the higher the chances are that it will get in front of the dev team. Granted, I do know that plenty of the dev team will still go there and read the Discord. So even if you post up a suggestion and you don't see it get a bajillion emotes on it, there's still a chance that someone on the team is still looking. So we do appreciate everything you guys are saying. That's right. And we want you guys to continue these discussions because you never know what you could say that could affect the game. <laughs> We're watching you. Yeah. Um, yeah as for <laughs> character customization, um, it is being thought about, but right now the, the priority is, you know, getting more content for the game, more stuff for, for players' experience. Uh, I th I'm, maybe maybe later down the road, uh, it, there could be possible cosmetics. Well, the insect be behavior vlogs that's something that i would like to come back to and redo now that we have more insects and like follow them around for a day like let's follow arthur the ant and see what he does <laughs> and then that way i could share it and get some like what was it the the word pop-up the the you know what i'm talking about where it's like someone's talking and it's also like like a speech bubble yeah, during it. <laughs> so that way we could have like the dev commentating 
in the speech bubble while we're following Arthur. It's his name now. I guess I named my Aunt Arthur. We're good. It's <laughs> cannon. I get from here. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah, just spam some. Sick oh, look shots at that. Here. Nothing but net all day. <laughs> Oops. Oh, speaking of. Oh, trying to get the bank. Oh! The voice actor for that. She's gonna love to hear that it's still there. Alright, I got one rock left. Yeah. Do it. This is the, the emote Zach worked on. <laughs> oh no. I'm seeing a bug. Oh. Oh. Oh, nice. Did Justin Bell do those riffs? No, so I think uh, yeah. Zach Simon, when he was on the project for a bit, the other Zach, <laughs> um, <laughs> he had his friend uh, do some guitar licks uh, for us, and which turned out really, really cool. Oh, um, sick. His friend's in a band. Oh, yeah! <laughs> that is how Eric rocks out. It's true. Though not so much because I play in a ska band, so it's not as rocking. <laughs> <laughs> more skanking. Yeah, more skanking, less rocking. <laughs> it's true. I did play in another ska band where I was uh, the cowbell master. <laughs> oh, really? Nice. Yeah. It's good stuff. Hey, the cowbell is severely underrated, so I'm really glad you were able to take that seriously. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people had a lot of fevers, so, you know, the only you know prescription was more cowbell, so... <laughs> <laughs> oh, just, you know, yes. Is the team working from home right now? Yes. Yep, we're um, as you can tell. We're we're all in our little our little homes. Yeah, I'm in I'm in the lab, so uh the, everyone else is at is at home. Yeah. Don't even know what the look office looks like anymore. It is, it is empty and time. lonely. No. <laughs> it's been a long time, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. I could just do this all day. Just See, I here, told you. Fine. That's all we needed. We need a oh, yeah. score count. I think we used to... We had one prototype, but I don't think we have one currently. Unless I'm wrong. Is it harder yeah, working from home? Um, yes and no. Um, you know, back in the office, if we had a question or something, we would just, uh, walk to someone's office and discuss it. So kind of, you kind of miss that interaction, but for the most yeah. part, you know, working from home has been pretty easy. Yeah. The commute's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> Although, um, my office mate, my dog is not very forgiving when it's work time. He doesn't seem to know the difference between work time and play time. <laughs> <laughs> yes, one oh, day yeah. we will have to commute. Playing a game of horse would be pretty easy. That would. See, now, back, um, I remember a few months ago, I saw someone build a giant bounce pad basketball court. And I think we should oh, add that right Ooh. next Ooh. to... Next to our Battle Royale bug that? arena, we can have a bounce pad basketball court. I don't think we can build it yet. I need, can need to discover the recipe. Yeah. All right, so we got a, a lure arena to build and a, mm -hmm. a bounce basketball yeah. court. I do also love, um, I did the this forever ago. Stone. If you attack an ant and then you lure him onto a, a bounce pad, he'll just like mm. fly. <laughs> oh, yeah, they you can just lure him. <laughs> Yeah. Get stuck too, because it's like they can't walk anywhere now, and they're just like, mm, "This is my life now. I am a bounce pad <laughs> amp." All right, warning has a question for all three of us. What is your favorite thing in the game at this moment? At this moment, I will say uh, this is going to be pretty generic, but the wildlife. Like, I love not just the animations and the creatures in there. Sometimes just sitting and listening. To the backyard it actually you still you're in a backyard but it makes you feel like you're somewhere else and most of it is because of the details in hearing all the birds chirp and the insects walk by 
That's one of my favorite things. That and just to watch watch the bugs go by. What about you guys? Uh, I guess just like kind of the same thing like this, all the different creatures you can encounter and how they like interact and live within the the world, like all the different biomes. Um, I like I like the idea that we're having like a bunch of different biomes. We're gonna we're gonna keep developing those further. So it's in having the creatures, um, you know, within specific areas. I think, um, but it's gonna be pretty cool. Uh, but that's why I like it's just the the ecosystem, I guess. Um, yeah, for me, it's it's definitely. Uh... I mean, just the, the wildlife you encounter in the game, that how they kind of have their own wants and needs. Like, gnats want, just want to bump you. They just want to boop you all day. Um, I love how the ants are curious, just like the AI for the for each insect is pretty awesome. I do also want to add that um, the lighting and the sunsets and the sunrises are also beautiful. Mm, yeah. And what we did today, like being able to play with you guys and build a base that's actually pretty fun, like, just to hang out. I mean, the last 30 minutes we've been sitting here talking to the, all you guys and chat and everything. Duncan. Yeah, yeah Duncan. Duncan. <laughs> there's so many, I think there's so many uh, aspects about this game that there's something in it for almost everybody. I mean, yeah. if you want PvP, I can just run over and throw my hammer at Eric and we could pretend. <laughs> let's, so, let's both attack Eric. No, no, no. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, oh God, we can see that real quick. Uh, hit that clover. Yeah. Uh, as for the zipline question, you can actually just drop your uh, your planks off, and they'll they'll roll down the zipline. You won't be able to hold it though, but you can send it one by one. Um, but yeah, let's yeah. see. That's where are we at. That's gonna yeah. That's time for us. Um, oh, cool. Wow, that was a that went by real fast. Yeah. Uh, we want to. Thank every single one of you, everyone in chat coming out and hanging out with us, asking all those questions, uh, having good laughs. Uh, thank you, Shyla, Zach, again for for coming out and joining us. Uh, yeah, thanks yeah. for having me. Um, it, was, it was a pleasure. It was a blast. I'm very happy. Uh, we will be back next week for another edition of Cur what? What did I call this? Casually grounded. <laughs> Um, so yeah, thank you again, everyone coming out. Uh, we'll see you next time and have a great rest of the day, morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are in the world. And, uh, we'll catch you next time. All right. Good Thanks, goodbye, everybody. Everyone. See ya. Bye-bye.